The Moon's orbit about the Earth lies in a plane which is tilted by about 5.15 degrees with respect to the plane of the Earth's orbit about the Sun. In this view we're looking from the centre of the Sun back towards the Earth and we can see the orbit of the Moon around the Earth. We're going to look at a time lapse of the Moon orbiting around the Earth and then I will speed it up. As you can see the Moon is heading around the back of the Earth. That would be full Moon just there. And we're coming around to third quarter right now. And as the Moon comes back around towards the Sun, as it passes the Earth is New Moon. And now we're heading out to first quarter right now, which is when the Moon looks like half a Moon in the sky. And now we're heading back to full Moon again. Now if I speed this up again, you'll see that the, the tilt of the orbit is changing from our perspective. The front side of the orbit is now tilting down below the Earth and it will get lower and lower and then it'll start coming back up again. And this is why the position of the Moon is constantly changing from month to month in its position where it rises on the horizon. Sometimes it rises further to the north, sometimes it rises further to the south. It very rarely rises due east. Now when the Sun, the Earth and the Moon are in a direct line, we see an eclipse. When the Moon is between the Sun and the Earth, we have a solar eclipse. When the Moon is in a direct line with the Sun and the Earth behind the Earth, we have a lunar eclipse. If the tilt of the Moon's orbit was exactly as the same plane as the Earth's orbit around the Sun, then we would see an eclipse every month. We would see a lunar eclipse and a solar eclipse every month. But because of the tilt of the Moon's orbit around the Earth, we only see an eclipse occasionally.